sliver lies betrayed and bleeding. Something incredible occurs. For though she does not know it, Sivir is the last in the bloodline of Azir, Sharima's lost emperor. And as her blood soaks into the ancient sands, a deep magic sparks to life. Resurrection. First Azir's mind, then his body, snatched back from oblivion to be reborn. Then he sees Sivir, wonders at her face. He sees himself in this daughter of Shirima. In that moment, he has no thought of empires or rituals. He only knows she needs his help. He must take her to the oasis of the dawn the mother of life. He smells the waters, smells of life. He prays he's in time. He does not dream that he, Sharima's greatest emperor, can at long last earn his ascension and bring back his broken city. He dares not dream that if he can save her, Azir, save them all.